Hey superstars, welcome back to one of my through the mail autograph videos where I doodle a player and bug him for an autograph. I was finally able to get my hands on some repacked wax, which is actually based very close to where I live. And let me tell you, this stuff is a lot of fun to rip. That 1958 Murray wall is really neat. Lots of good TTM targets here, but I can't pass up a good mustache. Time to draw Mr. Dan Schatziter. Shatsy here, and I don't have permission to call him that, but I'm trying to sound cool. Shatsy enjoyed a nice long 15 year career with nine teams because he was a left handed mustachioed reliever. Nothing wrong with that though, if you got it, flaunt it, right? And I don't have to make up the fact that he became a gym teacher at Wabonzi Valley High. Go Warriors! Because he did. And I love teachers. I hold teachers in higher regard than just about any other profession on earth. But he committed the ultimate sin. I saw a recent interview with him and he shaved that marvelous mustache. I had no idea what the interview was about or what he said. I could not get past the abhorrent lack of facial fuzz. This aggression will not stand, man. So, gym teacher, gym teacher, gym teacher, gym kata, gym, gym, Jimmy, gym. I can only assume he's the type of gym teacher that would say something like, Hey, all you panty waist, grab your sweat socks and get your butts into the gymnasium right this minute. It's time for four square. And you'd have to call him Coach Shatzeter even though you were only playing Foursquare. But I should be nice, right? Teachers deserve all the credit in the world. But he shaved that mustache. I'm so torn. Is he a good person or a bad person? Maybe there's no such thing. There is no black or white, only gray. And maybe people do good things to offset the bad and vice versa. Maybe that's what's wrong with the world. We need to embrace the grayness of everything. And there's a yin-yang duality to it all, like Jedi and Sith and balance to the Force and all that stuff. Is our true purpose to be as neutral as we possibly can be so there would be no really amazing people, but at the same time there would be no truly awful people in the world? Man, this is getting deep. Maybe he teaches philosophy too. This one came out pretty good, so does that mean I'm making up for a bad drawing I've done in the past? I don't know anymore, I'm so confused. Here's the 85 tops from that repacked wax pack, and in 87 tops I had lying around. Let's get that sticker on there and off to the overused mailbox footage. Let's see what we got. As always, I told him he could keep the doodle, sign the 87 and the 85 quite nicely, which must mean he signed somebody else's card poorly. Now I feel guilty, but I'm sure I'll feel good about something later. Thank you, Coach Shatsitter. Thank you guys for watching. Like or dislike, comment, subscribe, yada, yada, yada. Stay healthy, get sick, be kind, be a jerk, and we'll see you next week. I'm so confused.